Hey guys, welcome to the Fight Age channel. Friends, before starting to watch this video, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel. I really want to get 10,000 subscribers on my YouTube channel. It's so close. Thanks for supporting me, guys. American heavyweight Dante Wilder has once again suggested that his fourth fight with WBC world champion Tyson Fury is unavoidable. According to Dante, professional boxing is now more a business than a sport. So, as long as they both perform and attract fans, their confrontation will be relevant. There is definitely a chance that we will fight Tyson Fury again. Boxing is a business. A lot of people call it a sport, but it's not. The habit division is very small. And I'm still a big fish in this business, especially here in America. So, while we are playing in the time division and haven't finished our careers yet, why not? Everything is coming to this. There is no other way. Given all of the above, our fourth fight is unavoidable, Wilder said. Recall that Tyson and Dante meet three times in the ring. The first match ended in a draw, and the representative of Great Britain wore early victories in two. Former world champion and the first heavyweight Briton Tony Bellew showed his opinion about his compatriot Joe Joyce. According to Tony, Joe will be a problem for any heavyweight leader, and the only fighter who can knock him out is American Dante Wilder. I won't lie, guys. Joe is a problem for any heavyweight in the world. The only one who could potentially knock him out is Dante Wilder, or maybe Anthony Joshua. I'm not even sure if Yuri can do it. If you are not able to get rid of Joyce, then you have problems. He is very dangerous. Joe throws punches back, but there is some time he is constantly busy. In the fight with Parker, he struck 800 blows. 600 of them were dangerous to his rival. If you persistently knock on the wall, it will definitely fall. That's exactly what Joyce does. He fights at a pace that most heavyweights can't. Rivals cannot keep up with him. In addition, he strikes a lot of blows and his pace does not fall from this. I've never seen a fighter take such punches and keep moving forward. It's scary. He is just a machine that destroys souls, barely you say it. Frank Warren, a promoter of the WBC heavyweight champion Tyson Fury, confirmed that the fight with Anthony Joshua will not take place. According to the promoter, his word denies any possibility of resuming negotiations, since the team of a potential rival did not fulfill his requirements. Tyson is adamant. He said, that's enough. It's enough of Fury. So that's it. He is a champion, a man whose word matters. Tyson made a decision. This is his decision at the moment. The fight could only take place in one case if they sign a contract. Joshua's team didn't even send a contract to us with any amendments. Ten days have passed since they already have the contract. By this point, it will be possible to do a lot of things, after which we will say that there are positive aspects in the negotiations. Tyson is Tyson. He feels like he's giving AJ a huge opportunity after two defeats in a row and another 40% out of here. Warren said. Let's remind Fury gave Joshua until Monday to sign a contract. And after Anthony did not put his signature, he said that he would fight against Manuel Char. Warren said yesterday that there is hope to fix the situation. Thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel.